Well, welcome back. This is me, Sheila Wolk, and we're on page 20 and 21. I got a tripod. <laughs> Found one in my closet. And um, I'd like to read Sanctuary to you. Um, this painting was done in 2005. And it took me about a year and a half or longer to do. Uh, I was in no rush because it was quite an important piece to me, um, keeping in all the elements of uh, what I consider to be uh, a successful painting. So uh, I took my time, like I said, and there are certain things, elements in the painting that I wanted to point out to you. It has the circle you know, to show the sphere of uh, keeping the spectator's eyes in the painting. And what you really shouldn't do is have a bullseye. So I gave a double, double bullseye, and it detracted. It made it almost three-dimensional. And what does that mean? She's The angel is the bullseye. And then what I did was I added the fairy in front of her. And it detracted. It, it brought it more forward instead of the eye just going to her alone. So you're going into the painting, you're coming out a little bit, but the fairy's looking to the left, so you're going to start going in a circle, and you're going to come up to the little hummingbird, and then you're going back to the blue jay, and you're coming down to the fairy, opening her hands, and then you're going to come down to the other little fairies. This one's sleeping. Here's one. <laughs> so cute. Uh color of, I don't know if I can um, zoom in or not with this tripod. I'm trying this for the first time. I don't want to mess it up. Um, and then we're coming around to the other fairies, looking back into the painting. There's more to the painting, but we cropped it to give you more of the inside vision for the book. And then she's coming back up and looking back into the painting. Then the interesting thing about a successful piece of art are certain letters of the alphabet, Z. Z is important. She's, you're coming in. You always, in America, you commonly read from left to right English. So she's coming into the painting. Her eyes are a little bit off. You're going here, but the bird's preventing you from leaving. So you're coming back down to the other fairies, and then you continue reading, but she's bringing you back up. Okay, so there's your letter Z, the letter W, you know, that keeps your eyes within the painting. And then you've got the sign of the cross. You know, she's coming up and down, her knee into the wing, out of, and then starting all over again, back to the circle. So these are your different elements. You can use any of the elements in a painting, and it'll be quite successful. But the challenge I did with this painting was trying to get all of the elements in it at the same time. And it was my own conquest. And by the time I finished, the painting actually turned out better than what I hoped for. Um, so here it is, Sanctuary. And in the midst of all good things, where fairies flocked by angels' wings, the chirps and colored fluffs unfurled, paying grace to wisdom's pearl, Sanctuary seat reclined, a secret place so well defined. Do not awake, do not disturb, for peace and grace need not a word. And there you go, there's sanctuary. But after that, the company that usually does my figurines said, Your pieces, Sheila, are so darn complicated. How can we break this down to a simple form? And my answer was, It's easy, I'm the artist. And I'm reaching down to grab this. All paintings start with a drawing, and all drawings start with one line. So I broke it down to looking at all of my um, sketches for the painting and did some drawings, and they indulged, and they um, added some drawings too. And now let me see if I can take this. I don't think I can take it off the tripod without me ruining this. So I'll just lift it up and focus this way a little bit and pick her up. But I wanted to turn her around for you and to show you how lovely this um, figurine turned out. And they do consider this one of their better accomplishments of 
making a great figurine. It's quite heavy. Oh, look at a little birdie on top. I had to edit it. We had to take out butterflies and fairies and uh, a lot of birds in order to accomplish this and not make her too heavy. Um, she's heavy enough. Here's Wisdom's Pearl. Oops. They added a little string of pearls, which is really splendid. And we kept the little figure, the little um, fairy within her. So where'd she go? Okay, I got to back up a bit and go down. Oops, there we go. And there she is. Hmm, I don't know how to lower this thing. Um, I guess uh, this way. Okay, and I'm wasting time with this little video, but I'd like to really show you. There we go. And she's in there. We got a little pretty little, oops, now that's too, too close. We got a pretty little fairy inside sitting there. And then we got one little bumblebee. And we got another little bumble, bumblebee for nature. The birds, the flowers, the angel. Okay, thank you for visiting. And... I'll pick another poem next time, but until then, here we go with Sanctuary, and um, page 20 and 21 of my book, if you own it, and if not, come back and visit it again, and I hope if you have any questions, find me on Facebook and ask me. I'll be glad to answer any questions. Have a good day, and thanks for coming by.